हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द माय यूट्यूब चैनल के एस ऑटोमेशन सो इन टूडे लेक्चर आई गोना शेयर अबाउट हाउ टू रिस्टोर बैकअप ऑफ फैक्ट्री टॉक व्यू एप्लीकेशन मींस इफ यू हैव स्टोर्ड इफ यू हैव क्रिएटेड ए बैकअप ऑन Scada that you have created Scada you have created a Scada and you have created a backup to send to anyone or your colleagues to development next things or also you have to create a backup for particular date and with the particular date and time you have to change something in another backup after that you want to restore before then you have to implement you can implement so for that how you can restore the particular backup that you have already created in this video i am gonna share about so simply if you created backup if you don't know how to create backup in my previous in my previous video i explained how to create a backup with the help of factory talk view se application manager so if you don't know how to create backup so please go on my youtube channel and see this video after that you can easily know how to restore backup because first step create backup then you can store if you are create if you are back created backup in local station so you have to click in the local station click on local station so example you have you want to restore so here you can see restore application data from previous backup archive it means you have created a backup you want to restore so click on it restore backup here you can see one particular name that i i was creating in previous video here is showing archive if you don't know what is the file how example if you don't know what is the file of backup so you have to click on c drive and click on plus icon again in the user in the user public in the it is a path of a backup archive backup in the public public document rs enterprise rs view enterprise se se means side edition in the side edition you can see archives archives backup click on archive and it's i created the backup in the previous video so example you have you want uh, you can change any name one here you can see restore review here you can see review here you can see a review customized learning means it will be customized here application version 13 date created when you are created date here is you can see date of the creation and hmi server only one hmi server hmi server here you can see your server name your laptop your back here you can see your backup server name you you want to change name because if you create if you not if if you will not if you if you will not change name of the restore backup so it will be automatically override before override it will ask but it will be override click on store now its backup is storing in factory talk view application in factory talk view studio from where you can easily open particular backup i will show you you can see first checking the factory talk directory server it is a directory server i will explain in my coming videos when i will cover videos on that related to tools directory server checking hmi server connectivity and hmi server connectivity means name of the server backup name pre checking complete it's unzipping because we uh, after create backup time it's zip unzipping restore application and restore component server extracting project and restore completed 
you have to if you want you can see log file if you click on log file then here you can it will be generate a log also you can see all activity example you you example you have to share this log file particular log file to anyone you can see see log file and you can share so thank you for watching my video if you learn from my video so please hit the like button and subscribe my youtube channel for never miss new update because your like your subscribe it will be motivate me to create a new videos and give my information to other people they can learn and they can earn and they can grow thank you have a great day keep learning keep growing